Explorer's Shores, Bamboo Bluffs. Let the adventure begin. So we don't actually have the same sort of thing here. And maybe I should have taken my, uh... my fine golemy friend along, but I did not. And just getting wood from that, alright. Holy cow. A bamboo seed. Okay, so we can just, uh, you know, make the, uh, the bamboo float in air, huh? I wonder if it continues to grow if you... If you cut the tops off. That is a lot of bamboo that I'm getting. Well, it's actually a construction block, so I'm not sure how that's going to work. Although the tops look like they're just... ...things? So I don't know. Onsen time. Perhaps. Perhaps. Well, I have gotten a lot of bamboo. Ow! Rude! So this is, uh, the bamboo forest, basically. I don't know if there's anything else to get here. There are new trees down there, but... Nothing much to do with them. Yeah, bringing the, uh, the golem along would have made getting all this stuff a lot easier. Okay. And it's basically poles, so we can't, uh... Easily get through it if we, uh... Are running. Is there anything up top of the mountains? Other than ants? And whole layers of chunky chalk. Not exactly a whole lot of music here. Need ninja training to run through the bamboo. Oh no! I don't have that. Oh, oh, oh! I see something. Oh, well, actually, oh! Kitty! Thank you for the fish. Alright, what do we have here? Uh, buckwheat and buckwheat seeds. Alright. So this is a new crop. Pretty sure it's a DLC crop. There's quite a bit of it around here. I'll take your oil. Unfortunately, the uh, liquid metal slime doesn't seem to actually fight. 
Um, now that I'm thinking about it, because it was always like, uh, uh, help me. Which, I mean, I get. They, they are... Kind of scaredy cat monsters, but it's a little bit annoying because uh, I don't really care about the hearts that we can get out of him. So he might be someone who is let go as well. It's a real shame that there's such a limitation on the number of people you can have on your island. Maybe that'll increase in the post-game? I don't know, but I kind of doubt it. Alright, let's see. Brave, brave Sir Robin. Does what liquid metal slimes do best. Bravely run away. <laughs> yep. Is that something down there? Bet it'll go up as they add DLC. I don't know that they're going to add any more DLC, though. Rice! Okay. Well, that's right. We need, like, rice for, uh, rice paper screens, don't we? And I gotta do all the work on this myself now, without Malroth. Can't make Malroth do all my work for me. It's disappointing. Uh, no, no, uh, I, I definitely did not beat up Kitty. Uh, no, I, I don't know why you would, uh, think that. Uh, I'm beating up crabs, that's, that's what you heard, definitely. Yeah. I, I would, I would never, never beat up a Kitty with you around. No. I'm shocked that you would even think that. Once you get Builder Topias in the post game, uh, you get to put people there too. Well, that could be fun. Die crab. Malroth is having a moment. Several moments. Yeah. I, uh. I understand. You should get over it, though. Just like Lillian in the Colonel's Bequest. Just, you know, get over it in a reasonable way. Thought they said people would be here with quests? Um, I don't know about this one. I think the other one, maybe. I need more rice. There's some rice. I'm wondering if there are any super strong monsters here, though. I kind of don't think so. This is just super easy early monsters. If you're as much of a fan of Lulu as you are, you can give her your o her own island and all her friends can go there too. Which is why she's a sole occupant of Prison Island. <laughs> I actually don't dislike Lulu. I mean, when Malroth and I were kidnapped, she was, uh, resting, you know, she did set up a... 
straw pallet by the docks waiting for us to return. Which is more than anyone else did. I mean, the thing about Lulu is that she was like, uh, oh, it's my island, blah, 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 and then literally everyone else is doing the exact same thing, so... You know, I, I can't exactly hold that against her when everyone else is doing it, too. Even though it is clearly the Avatar's island. Actually, this isn't the Avatar, this is Ellie. Getting a massive amount of buckwheat. Not as much rice as I would like to get. She was only waiting for you to to make you build her a party boat. Well, I mean, she also, uh, um, you know, made some food for us. It's not her fault. Well, I mean, it is kind of her fault that it was bad, but, you know, I mean, it's a thought that counts. Bad, bad slime. Bad slime. Don't, don't claw me, slime. Bad, bad slime. <clears throat> leave that stuff floating in the air. Because we can. Do I still love Gengen, though? Well, I mean, Gengen's now a woman. She's a singer. Gengen is even better than Gengen was before. She, uh, probably is not immortal like she was before, though. So, she may need to think about whether this is a good career change for her. I mean, Malroth liked her cooking. Exactly, you know. Well, that is quite a bit that we have wandered around. Really need to decide what color I want to make this uh, winter coat. It is just adorable. And red does suit it, but, you know. The kitty has wiggle butts. Kitties do tend to have wiggle butts. It's, uh, it's definitely a, a kitty thing. <laughs> Brittany, guard me while I sleep. <laughs> Ellie is going for that harem ending with Brittany, Gengen, and Lulu. <laughs> I mean, if there were, like... more male characters other than the ones who betray you, the uh, ones kind of enjoying gimp suits, and uh, the old guys, uh, you know. I mean, I guess there's Clayton. I mean, not uh, Clayton Perry, but... I need more inland water game. Less beach. More there is some inland water. Does it have what I want though? That's the question. Need more rice. How much rice do I have right now? Uh do do do. Wow, those are... those are shimmery. The shining seed of a blessed blossom. Um, 
Oh. They decided to put it down there. Uh, let's see. Five rice. Where's the actual rice seeds? Oh, uh, rice seeds. Oh, rice plant seed. Fifteen. Yeah, I need more. Warwick became a monkey. <laughs> Did, yeah. You'd rather be a monkey than spend time with Ellie. I mean, you know. That's, uh... It's just shocking. Any more rice in here? I... see none. I do see some that I missed. Still more land over this way, however. More opportunities for rice. There's some rice. Alright, any more rice? Okay, uh, so that's, this is inland water, this I don't think is. We'll get the bamboo seeds, right? Definitely gonna have to test this to see if it, it grows bamboo if you plant it and leave it in the ground. And just cut out the tops if it continues to grow. Like some more rice, though. Yeah, it's all inland, uh, or seawater. Pretty sure that's all seawater. Uh, looks like there might be some over here. It's kind of a shame you can't, uh, climb up the bamboo. You have kelp, rice, and fish. I think there may be a recipe there. There may be. I'm going to need to get some more kelp, though, because uh, it tends to go pretty quick. I should actually get some. I mean, like, I can get kelp around here, so. Alright, inland water. Is there any rice in here? Nope, I've already gotten it. There's enough kelp to do some testing. Alright, but we've already been here. Um, let's try cutting across, see what we see. That looks like more inland water over there. Yeah, you made noise. 
what you get, slime. Okay, there is more inland water over here. Is there any rice? There is, but it looks like I've already gotten it. Wait, why isn't Zara with you? Because I just haven't brought her along? Brittany's with me. Brittany's my go-to uh, military companion. I mean, I like Zara, too. Don't get me wrong. I like Anessa, as well. Coastal water. Alright, what do we, uh, right over that way? Oh, that's some buckwheat that I missed. Well, that is disappointing. Hello! Guess what? You're dead. I'm sorry. Did you plan to survive? Because you didn't. Hmm. And much disappointment, disappointment was had by me. Uh, you can't... Uh, I can't add a... I mean, I can add... I could have a bunch of people going with me. It doesn't have to just be, uh... Oops. On the wrong, uh, tool. I mean, I could definitely go to these islands with, uh, um... Brittany, Anessa, and Zara. They're just doing, you know, building, though. Just a big, boring expanse of, uh, mountainy crud. I miss this buckwheat. So I'll go ahead and get it. Doesn't look like there are any uh, super strong monsters, though, which I'm not really surprised about. At all. It's a little bit of a shame, but... Ellie loves a woman in uniform? How come you don't like Rosie no more? I like Rosie. Rosie just doesn't fight. there's much else for us to pick up. I'm pretty sure that's all inland sea. I mean, maybe up there, but I don't think there's going to be a Builderdom's best here. So, yeah, let's just uh let's just pop back. Yeah, I'm not I'm not surprised at all. But it's worth a ch worth a check, you know.
And we'll go to the other explorer's shore and see what it has to offer. Alright, enough with the cow game, please, seriously. Like, we have seen that cow so many times. It was amusing the first time. Maybe even the second time. Hey, castle's 15% complete. Okay, well, since you guys have asked about it... Add to party. You can't choose them yet. Oh. Okay. I can't choose them yet. Well, in that case... Although, I need a better weapon for you. Yeah, still part of the plot. What did I build on the port? Well, it was going to be a uh, uh, a warehouse, but uh, it's kind of turned into just a room full of uh, treasure chests. There you go, Babs. Yeah, they're busy building the castle. That's fine. Alright, let's go to Angler's Isle. I mean, what kind of annoys me is that it's like, once you like something, it never shows up. But if you haven't liked a, a picture, but yeah, they'll keep showing it to you. Oh. You guys can't come? Aww. Fine. Be that way. Bye. Bye, friends. So sad. A fish fancier's favorite place. Oh, place. Pl Seriously, game? Seriously. Going solo for this one. Yep. I bet I could have uh, Malroth if... Oh, hey, I just saw some of the stuff uh, load in. Squab me with a squib. Here we are, Angler's Isle. Oi, there's someone over yonder. Could be the person who penned that letter. Why not lover over and invoke the right of parley? I'll stay here and make sure the ship's boat shape. If you want to return to the Isle of Awakening, all you need to do is ask. I bet if we still had Malroth with us, we'd still have Malroth with us. What? You, you've stolen Anessa's hair, you know. Okay, I was not expecting uh, that outfit. I'm not even sure if I've seen this outfit in any, uh... Any Dragon Quest game before. All right, but first of all, all right, we do have our um, our thingy, ice and wood for the ice lolly. Okay, that's good to know, and it's under there. There's a newish notebook with frolicking with fish written on it. Do you want to take a closer look? Yes. Oh, all the pages are completely blank. Nah, I'm good. Well, this is not a very big place at all, is it? <laughs> uh, the water seems to be going down. Oh, oh. Oh my. Oh my. There's a lot here. 
seagrass. Anemone. Colossal coral. Pillar coral and coral. And of course, kelp. That is some interesting stuff there. This is also a very deep uh, hole right here. So, why not go down it, right? Well, first of all, let's... Let's get some air. Red seagrass. That's kind of neat. Okay, there's different anemones. Blue anemone. That's another one of those anemones. Gets more air. That's kind of neat. I mean, you know. Different color corals, too? Yeah, it could be. I haven't looked too close. We got uh, colossal coral and just coral, though. Uh, let's see. I think those are the same. So it might be other ones. And I seem to be in a dead end. Can I get up here? Nope. Alright, I can get up there. Ooh. There's some fencing. I hope you don't mind. I was, uh, you know, looking around under your uh, island. Alright, let's talk to you. Can't believe that Bloomin' Plonker went and carked it. He proper left me in the lurch this time. What? Who the bleeding neck are you? And what are you doing on me island? Eh? You're a builder and you're saying you read me letter? Sorry, mate, but I don't know what you're chatting. I ain't written no letters. Look, I ain't really in the mood to natter. My mate's gone missing and me nets are knackered. You seem like a nice lass, but do us a favor and jog on, yeah? I didn't come here to make new friends, so just leave me be. Oh, well, all right. Bye. No, I just wanted to come over here because I noticed that there was a sign that I hadn't read. There's an old signpost with something written on it. Everything that has ever been or ever will be falls into one of two classes. That which can be fished and that which cannot. One should strive to be the fisher, not the fish. Okay. She's a right friendly one, ain't she? Exactly. I asked you to leave me alone, but you still want to have a chat. Don't nothing phase you, eh? Maybe you can help me out then. See that netting over there? That's me fish cage. Problem is, it's all broken and I don't know how to fix it. If you're really a builder, why don't you make some netting and fix the damage? Eureka! Ellie learns a new recipe! Netting, a woven string stretched to fashion a form of see-through wall. I will fix your netting. I will fix your netting. I will fix your netting. Alrighty. Netting, all it takes is cord. It takes a lot of cord, though. No, I probably don't need that much. Sploosh! Fish cage! It's a lot of fish cages.
There, happy? Fish cage, netting and pure water. One netting and ten pure water? Well, that's interesting. And a uh, change type. Uh, Seawater, muddy water, hot water, pure water. Huh. Hello? Gordon Bennett's a Barracuda's brother. You fit it, fixed me fish cage up good and proper. You really are a builder after all. Thanks for that. You might just have saved me bacon there. But if I was a follower of the children, I'd be beating the living daylights out of you right now. Lucky for you, I ain't. Anyway, Jillian's the name. I fled me home and came here as far away as I could get. There ain't nothing to do on this island but fish. Maybe that should be Gillian. Because, you know, Gil. I'm going to stick with Jillian, though. So what are you doing all the way out here, anyhow? Are you fishing, too? Um, sure. Pull the other one. You ain't no angler, you're a fish. I can spot your kind a mile off. Yep. Tell you what, you can have this. Consider it a little thank you present for mending me nets. New tool acquired. Cast a line and lure in some lovely lunkers. I'd make a sound, though. Tooltip, fishing rod. River or lake, pond or ocean, wherever there's water, you'll find fish. So if you see a wet patch, cast a line and play the waiting game. Well, I don't mind if I do. I see you, fish. I see you, fish. Yeah, fish, fish, fish. Ah, oh, failure. Did it too soon. Come on, fish. Yeah, fish, fish, fish. Perfect hit! Well, it's easier than uh, Stardew Valley, that's for sure. You don't have the DLC yourself yet, but you read that you can fish different types of fish from the different water types. I'm not surprised. I got a first striked beak fish. I will put fish away. Catch lots of different types of fish. Here, fishy fish. Here, fishy fish, fish. Another striked beak fish. Here, fish, fishy fish. I mean, I've got pretty good at fishing, too. It just takes a lot of practice, that's all. Another striked beak fish. I can can I get something else? Maybe it's the uh, the depth of the water. No, I'm just getting striked beak, beak fish. All right. I don't know what was written on that letter you, f you read, but whatever it said, I can tell it's lit the fish and fire in your belly. Want me to teach you ancient mysteries of the fishing? It ain't like nothing, like I got nothing better to do. Sure. That's the answer I wanted. From now on, you're me apprentice. I'll train you up into a first class fisher, you'll see. Now see that rocky butt bit what's jutting out into the sea? That's the best spot on the island for a fledgling fisher to start. So when you're ready, pop over there and cast off. But I'm, I'm not a Japanese figure that you can remove the clothes from. Oh, oh, you meant with the rod. Got it. Once you caught something, come and show me. I want to see if I was right to take you under my wing. See so if you can catch a mackerel. You can't release that fish here.
So apparently the fish are gonna live for a while in my uh, inventory, which I suppose is good. <laughs> Here, here, fishy fish. Come here, you're mine. It's a striked beak fish. Like, like seriously, game. Can I, can I get something other than a striked beak fish? Here, fishy fish. Here, fishy fishy fish. Gotcha, fish. It is a striped beak fish. Don't say with a rod after talking about removing the figure's clothing. <laughs> Alright, uh... Can, can I get anything other than a striped beak fish? No, no, I can't get anything other than a striped beak fish. Malpoo. Well, can I at least cook the striped beef fish? I can. What, don't you know what to do? Want me to give you the lowdown? Sure. The first thing you gotta do is stand near the water. If you can dangle your line or your, line or your fishing rod in the old wet stuff, you're good to go. If you see the fish milling about, it means they're interested. But you gotta be patient. Wait till you feel a little tug. Press X sharpish to stag the sucker. The skill comes with watching the water. Once you get a bite, the fish will drag your float down below. That's the signal you've been waiting for. From that moment on, it's a game of catfish and mousefish. All you gotta do is press X and reel the beauty in. See them rocks over there? That's the best place to... Maybe she's not talking about this... that spot over there. Righto, if I can give you one piece of advice, it's this. Don't think too much about it, and just go with the flow. Now, don't come back till you caught something. I, I have caught something. Oh, right here, okay. That might make the difference. It. Ellie catches her first mackerel! Holy mackerel! You know what? I want a snapshot of this. Uh, zoom. Apparently my tongue is white. Or maybe my dress is clipping through it. Yeah, I'll go with this. Uh, let's see. We'll take it.
Let's go with sepia. Yeah, I, I think that my uh, my the collar of my dress was clipping in to the mouth. 